In 2000, my dad was murdered protecting someone. And the knock-on effects that had on my family was, uh, was huge. Someone was getting beaten up and he stood in and, and got beaten to death. Bullying is such a rife thing. It, you know, it happens in the workplace, playground, in sport. You've either been around bullying, you've been the bullier, or you've been bullied. And I could relate to suffering at the hands of other people to the point, you know, what you know, everything that happened to my dad. The whole thing with the foundation is to get people not to be bystanders, you know, to, to be upstanders and uh, make a difference to someone's life. Because if someone could speak up at the right time or, or stand alongside someone who needs to be stood next to, it could make a massive impact in their lives. We wanted to elevate that message and look at the crisis moment of now, which is homophobia, whether it be casual homophobia in the playground where kids will say gay, faggot, homo and teachers walk by and ignore it. They wouldn't necessarily do that with racism. Now that process has to happen with homophobia. It is about acceptance, it's about understanding and, and, and educating. The sport shouldn't discriminate. You know, you should be judged on your, your talent and not your sexual orientation. And, and that's, you know, what people need to understand, you know, because someone's gay doesn't mean they're, they're different. To all the GB team, go and have a blast and embrace every moment and good luck.